What is up guys? It is the Turtle Girl. Welcome to the channel or welcome back to the channel. Today, Sienna, my milk snake, is going to finally be moved out of her quarantine enclosure. Which she's technically not getting actually like moved out of it. She'll still be in the same tank. But we're just moving her off of paper towel onto Aspen, which it conveniently has a milk snake on it. But she'll be moving on to Aspen today because I've had her for two months now. So I think she's in the clear. She's been pooping regularly, eating regularly, doesn't seem to be having any issues, no mites, nothing. So we're gonna go ahead and update her enclosure and I thought I'd take you guys along for that. But before we get started, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and ring the notification bell so you can see all of my future videos. I make turtle videos, pet videos, and fun content and I upload every single Friday. So you don't wanna miss out, hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell, and with that, let's get started. All right, so you can can see that we have her set up here and you can see her little nose poking out here so we're gonna go ahead and take everything out of the enclosure put it off to the side move her out of the enclosure and then put in the aspen and potentially some other decorations to kind of finalize this setup but hopefully you can see everything okay and we're gonna get started comes the snake. And I believe she's in this hide. Usually she spends a good amount of time in here. But let's see if we can get her out. Oops, and there's Sienna. Let's go back down there for a second. Let me get this all set up. And I'm gonna be keeping her in here all put away so that she's not squirming around. Sorry, girl. As you can see, she can be very flighty when I first initially grab her, but she hasn't really musked. She's only musked on me once. It just takes a couple seconds for her to calm down. So I'm gonna go ahead and get her in here. Oops, baby, it's okay. Get your little tail in there. All right, here we have the Aspen. So we're gonna go ahead and add this in there. layers about enough in some places it's about half an inch it's about half an inch to an inch now again this is my first snake so if you guys have any suggestions dealing with anything definitely let me know in the comments below but for right now I think about this much looks pretty good to me I'm just gonna try to even it out a little bit all right cool so now with all the shredded aspen in here I'm gonna go ahead and put in the rest of the decorations back in So I have a couple more fake plant picks that I'm gonna be using inside this tank. So hopefully that'll work out well, just so that it has a little bit more color, a little bit more, I don't know, depth dimension things for Sienna to explore. So I'm gonna put a couple of these into the enclosure. So I think that looks about good. Let me give you a quick look of what this setup looks like. So you can kind of see how this is all set up. We've got the warm hide right here, the humid hide, which is this little Tupperware. We've got this piece of cork bark, this alligator kind of in the center along with some fake plants, this little hide on the cool side, and then the water dish on the cool side as well. And so that looks pretty good to me. She still has plenty of space to move around. It's just, you know, a little bit of decorations and enrichment. So we'll see how she likes it. Gonna go ahead and release her now. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and put the lid back on and then we can release Sienna. And she'll be going into her new tank.
All right, so now for the moment of truth, I'm gonna go ahead and release Sienna. All right, girly, go ahead and head into your new home. Go down, not, where are you going? There you go. Go ahead and go exploring. Looks like she's heading straight for that hide. So I'm sure she will use do a little bit more exploring. I'm sure right now she's a little bit um, discombobulated because we just added some Aspen. But we'll check in on her in a little bit and see how she's liking the tank. So there she is right now. There's her little face. And she's just hanging out by her water bowl. Hello. You're a little cutie. So that is today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing Sienna get her new enclosure, new enclosure all set up and out of quarantine finally. She's doing really well. I'm super pleased with how it turned out. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to drop a thumbs up down below, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you all next Friday. Have a totally awesome day. Bye-bye.